found him! Marco! What the? Was that Sandman? MJ wasn't kidding. We gotta help him before he hurts someone. Or himself. Maybe he's hungry. Should toss the big guy a snack. What's the plan? Keep him busy. I got an idea. You should try yoga! <laughs> Must be more of a Pilates guy. That was your idea? Never said it was a good one! It was supposed to be a normal day. Teach physics, have awkward conversations in the teacher's lounge! Come <laughs> on. 
Genki to work his magic. Genki, you there? Nuts! I know, man. But listen, we need a big water source by Wall Street. Well, let me check the grid. Stay safe, dude. You too, Mr. Parker. Will do. Wait, what? Who knows? Genki knows all. Plus, we were super weird in class earlier. You I never should have taught in a gifted school. Give him today's forecast, Spider-Man. 100% chance of rain. Got it right when we want him. Guys, the water tank on the Matheson building should do the trick. We're talking 10,000 gallons here. Got it. Thanks, Genki. Should have stayed away, spiders. Still think we got him right where we want him? And I may have spoken too soon. And he's definitely getting bigger. Keep climbing. We're so close. The water tank. Spider-Man? I just wanted to live normal. Like everyone else. This isn't the way, Marco. For a guy like me, there is no other way. Yes, safe. Get into any college or want it. Or Spider-Man would. 
right. Brainstorm later, Mouse. Focus. wasn't stable, but here goes nothing! <laughs> the web wings? They're flying! But we're not out of this yet! Marco's in Pier 4 Beach! What happens if he gets all that sand? Pinky just did! Gonna need you ASAP, Miles! Yeah, I see him all right! I'm right behind you! Myself into. You gotta calm down, Marco. Innocent people are in danger. You care about them, but not me. They wouldn't listen to Marco. They can't ignore Sandman. Sand everywhere. Wow. 
Marco, it's gonna be okay. I haven't been okay for a long time. If you need help, all you have to do is ask. You're the ones who are gonna need help when they come for you. Ready for your annual physical? are involved. Slow down! 
Officers! You're not helping! Are you kidding me, Connors?
inject the antidote into his gums if I get close enough! <laughs> Where did you get that? Harry Osborne. He, he said you designed it. Come with me. It's over here. Whoa, 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 back off. I'm going in for a closer look. It's okay, it's okay. fragment of a meteorite that landed outside the city years ago. It's where we found that. I'm wearing an alien. We call it a symbiote. It, it bonds at the subcellular level with its host. Uh, in our case, Harry Osborn. He gave it to you? Not exactly. I was hurt, and... And it chose you. Which means it's more dangerous than I could have imagined. We need to call Oscorp. We need to destroy it. Destroy us? You said it chose me, Doc. Makes me a better Spider-Man. I have to get out of here and call Spider-Man. If he's okay. Okay. What's going on? This is...
I tried. I expected you sooner. Where is the energy of youth, huh? Fight to the death. Or die here together. So how many people did you kill before I got here? I didn't have a choice. You always have a choice. I am done wasting my time fighting weakling. Prove you are worthy of my life. I understand you want to kill me. But I can't let you do that. What makes you think you deserve to live? I won't die as the man that I was. You are stronger than you appear, little one. But do not underestimate your energy. You don't get to walk away from what you did. The inner demon? Devil's breath? The city hall bombing? Don't recount my sins to me. I know what I did. You have no idea. Did Craven bring you here? Or was this voluntary? Save your superiority complex. We're both in the street. Yeah. Looks like serving time didn't change you at all. You're wrong. He awakened something, Spider. And you in him. You'll never defeat me. Spider-Man doesn't kill. You never fought this one.
keep my head in the game. I'm not really here right now. None of this is real. What's more real than fear? What are you doing to me? Taking a look into your soul. I see a boy terrified of being alone, of failing his family. Keep talking! You're not getting away from me! is you, right? All you do is take. You put me in danger. You put Haley in danger. But for what? What do we get? I... I know I'm... Left behind. That's all we get. Or we end up like Finn. Kenki! Kenki! I know I said it wasn't your fault, but... I guess I just mostly felt bad for you. I didn't want you to feel responsible. Especially after... Don't! Especially after you- Shut up! This ends when you want it to, Miles. You're going to let me in eventually. And until then, struggle. Always in danger. No! You're going to get yourself killed. I won't! And then what? You can't win, Miles. I should never have let you try. All it's ever done is make me more alone. Put me in more danger. No! I want to protect you! I will! I heard that before. Enid! Not from you. On the day he died, Mom. your father told me just that morning that everything he does no 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 miles please i love you that's enough lee miles i said that's enough you're right it's more than enough i have everything i need
Hey there, big man. Man, it feels good to see you. Lots changed since I left. You became a whole hero. I couldn't save you. Poor Finn. If Spider-Man can't protect everyone, who will? No more now. No more than just Spider-Man. You can try and hide behind that mask, but I know who you are. And what you stand for. I've been watching you. You have? And it hurts. What happened to the boy that I raised? A coward. Staying from my family. You don't mean that! I do. We all do. You're a failure, Miles. Always will be. No! You'd never say that! None of you would! I'm not- It's time to give up. Give up, Miles. No. Give up! I won't. Give up. Give up. Give up. I'm not doing this anymore. You want to know who I am? I'm the kid whose dad you killed at City Hall. What? He died because you decided your problems were more important than all of those people's lives. Jefferson Davis was a hero who saved people from you. listening to you. Losing my dad? It's not what's holding me back. I was the one doing that. But not anymore. Let them escape! <laughs> That material is unbreakable. But I believe anything can be broken.
Let us make this a glorious ending! You destroyed my city! Took the lives of so many people! That was their fate. Just as this is ours. Your followers treat you like some kind of god! But you're just a dying old man! Looking for a way out! Huh. So you know that! I will not die in a sick bed! Only an evil may taste my last breath! Rip me apart and parade your achievement through the streets! Come! Do not hold back! I hope you're enjoying this. Tonight won't end well for you. I study all of my prey. You are agile, intelligent, vulnerable to emotion. So am I. Do not let the taste of power get to your head. Just me. You almost killed him, man. What are you doing? You're in the 
way, Miles! Always in the way. Ah! I could have fixed everything! How? By strangling him? That's not what we do! Don't try to mentor me! You're the one running away from your problems! You're the one hell-bent on revenge! Uh, 
These last few days. Miles, I'm sorry. Thank you for everything. So what Spider-Man do? <clears throat> Spider-Man didn't save me back there. Miles did. <clears throat> what now? I have to talk to Dr. Connors. He said he knows how to destroy it. Wait, what about Harry? Doesn't he kind of need it? His dad is working on another cure. One that doesn't involve aliens. You know, if you need me, I'm just a call away. Well, once I let my mom know this, she still has a son. I know. It's glad to have you back, man. That's 
me feel it! Jay, where's... Harry. Pete? You look tense. Coffee? We need to talk. You must get tired making the world a better place every single day. But I can help. All you have to do is let me. This isn't you. Wrong. This is the real me. I finally have the power to realize our vision. Giving up on me? Harry, we need to get that thing off you. Do not call us a thing.
just want to stay the stronger half! Why? Don't feel special anymore? What? No! You're stronger than me in so many ways! You've been single-handedly holding our lives together! I'm sorry, MJ! I took you for granted! MJ is gone! No! You aren't! I'm sorry I caused you so much pain! The house! My job! Our life together! I promised you I'd be better, but I wasn't! I should have listened! We should have been there! We're a team! Me and you! I never want your life to be worse, to make mine better! Your dreams are just as important as mine! You're lying! You're just as important! Enough! my ass. I quit. What's up? You're so cool. I thought I'd lost you. I think I've been lost for a while now. Not just to the symbiote. For months I've been trying to be something I'm not. I'm glad you're back. It wasn't you. And I wasn't me earlier. Pete, I... Pete, it... It was like some kind of hive mind in there. I saw you. And Harry... He, he was going after this... rock. Miles is at City Hall. Go. I love you. I love you. <sighs> Who said anything about Oscorp? <laughs> himself as I prophesied yeah. no. no I knew you had it in you Yuri uh. 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 there that'll keep pressure on it until I can uh. 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 
If you want the flame, you're gonna have to go through me! Then you're about to swallow a lot of blood! You're going to have to kill him, Yuri! My prophecy says he'll never stop! Just like you! I'll finish you when I'm done! The flame needs to die, Spider-Man! The longer he lives, the more people will get hurt! There are other ways to stop him! Less traumatic ways! This path you're on never ends well, Yuri. Trust me! Trust you? What about you trusting me? You weren't there the last time he escaped! You didn't find the bodies! You didn't see his face! No, I can't even imagine! But that still doesn't make this right! I am not letting him get away again! I don't die. Congratulations. You get to live out the rest of your life behind bars. And I owe it all to you. your priorities because I'd rather lose sleep over the one person I killed than all the ones I didn't save okay where's Beck welcome spider-man if you're looking for Betsy and Cole 
They are no longer with us. You killed them? Don't act surprised. You've known from the beginning who you're dealing with. What the... Nice try. Clutch Spider. You can win. I am infinite. Oh, when you are dead, you finally get to Surprise? Maybe it's time for you to put some respect on my name. Yeah. 
down. Get it back. I'm trying. It was Quentin. He made us do this. Where is he? questions. This should clear things up. So can I tell everyone Mysterio's a good guy now? <laughs> Mysterio will always be a villain. Just as Spider-Man will always be a hero. It's when you start looking at the people behind the masks that things get messy. this again! <laughs> I thought we lost you. Guess I should thank you. Years of my life consumed with vengeance. I lost everything for it. You two reminded me that that's not who I am. When you help someone, you help everyone. Where are you gonna go? To set things right. Your way. Wow. Reforming your greatest enemy. Can't say I've ever done that. Maybe MJ was right. Why would the city need me when it has you? <laughs> I don't know. This city still looks like a two Spider-Man job to me. Yeah. <laughs> 
pretty sure your plus one isn't invited to our high school reunion, Harry! Harry! My best! 
best friend! Then why don't you trust us? Who are these guys? I trust you, Harry! Not that thing you're wearing! I got a thing. Heal the world with you! Not like this! The meteorite. You took it from us!
nightmare. I'm waking you up.
I'm done. Either way, Pete. We still have time? No, we don't. It'll kill them. And then it'll kill you. Let's heal the world, Pete. Together. Give me some room. I don't know if it's gonna work, but I gotta try.
pulse is weak. We gotta move. What have you done? What have you done to him? I'm so sorry. I'm coming with you, wait. There are traces of brain activity, but his chances of coming back are very slim. Just keep him alive. Get the G serum ready. ASAP. For the last few years, tragedy has tried to tear the city apart. But we somehow kept going. We battled sickness, evil, Cataclysm. We are tired, anxious, stressed, numb. But we have never lost hope. The city needs to heal. We're all ready to return to normal, but what is normal? What if it no longer exists? Over the last half hour, I've talked about how these events have changed me. But what about you? In this ongoing series, I will be talking with people throughout the city, exploring our new behaviors, new routines, new thoughts and feelings. I hope you'll join me on this journey. This has been Mary Jane Watson, and you're listening to The New Normal. Episode one, done. Nice. <laughs> I don't know. Ooh, are these good to go? In a minute, I want to show you something first. Okay. It has molasses in it. Yum, I'll take those. <laughs> Thanks again for the donation, Peter. Have you talked to Miles about? Not yet. <sighs> he 
You ready? Uh, Miles. I've been meaning to talk to you uh, about something. Uh, I mean, I have been talking to you there all, all the time. It's, it's, it's great uh, to talk. So many good talks. I just haven't been talking to you about what I should have been talking to you about. Pete. Uh, wait, uh, let me start again. I got this. All of it. Go be Peter Parker for a while. Are you... Are you sure? It's... It's a big city. I can handle it. As long as I can still call you for advice. You don't need it. <sighs> Maybe not now, but... There'll come a time. I'm here for you. Always. Hey, bro. What do you want? The Spider-Men. You know who they are, don't you? Why? They ruined my son. We all have to experience loss. Even you, Norman. What are you writing? The final chapter. You're hungry. Food's almost ready. Why don't you go show her your essay? He worked so hard on it. guy in Harlem, probably seen him volunteering in the city, helping out his city council mom, and trying to live up to his hero dad. Yeah. Thank you. 
This is Albert. Uh, hi. Nice to meet you. Oh, and uh, <laughs> this is my daughter, Cindy. What's up, New York? Welcome back, Dana Club. We did it. We survived the impossible, drove back a friggin' alien invasion, and we did it together as heroes. The Spider-Man led the way, and every day New Yorkers rose to the challenge. Today, I am so pleased to talk with one of those heroes, author, journalist, and avid motorcyclist. Please welcome Mary Jane Watson. Thanks, Danica. Please call me MJ. MJ it is. So, I ate up your book about Simcaria in a single sitting. Thank you for giving this to the world. It's so important. I heard we're going to get even more of your words in the form of a new project. Can you tell us more about it? Happy to. I've been thinking a lot about what's really important. Nothing will make you rethink your life like a citywide alien invasion, right? Relatable. And I realized how important the truth is. I started a podcast called The New Normal. I don't know where New York is headed, but I'm looking forward to finding out. With all of you out there, I want to be honest and report what's really happening in the city. Straight up. No exaggerations, no clickbait, you know? I know exactly what you mean. When you let that junk creep in, it takes over the truth. Warps it into something else, like a, a, like a symbiote. Mary Jane Watson, everybody. Any last notes you'd like to leave us with? Stay safe out there. Oh, and if you have motorcycle insurance, make sure it includes a villain damage clause. I can feel the pain in your voice there. I'm working through it. Danica Hart and Mary Jane Watson, signing off.